five minutes before thinking he had it. Now it's a question of him having to come back like he tried on Hub. He's proven he can. The question is though, how long does he have before CZM will be able to pull away? Because CZM is a player that will continue to go aggressive. I've not seen him go defensive once this tournament. It's very true and a very good question too. Seven minutes, 47 seconds now, so we are more than halfway over. CZM with the armor health advantage. Actually, uh, Cooler has more armor, but now CZM after grabbing that red is going to be more pumped up for Cooler at 142, 132. There's a mid-level to top-level shaft battle, and CZM even given a nice little nice bind there. It's a 3-3, three three, still a tie game. This one could go defensive up until the 15-minute mark. Wouldn't it be great to see that and then end it in such depth overtime? Well, all I want to know is why did we have an all-star game when we could have had a best-of-five final? Because that would have been something special. Yeah, there we go. LG battle, CZM will drop down to that red armor, will collect. He actually had no, none red armor at all, but the uh, rockets will rain down, just ch chip away at that. He's only got 54 left up. There is CZM taking a lot of damage, 66 and 4. What a rocket there from Cooler. Crucial timing as well. CZM just spamming those grenades down to the Mega, moving his way across the, across the top of the level, rocket in hand, and uh, just can't lock Cooler down. LG coming forward from Cooler, 96 HP in for CZM, and now uh, CZM will try to give chase with those rockets, but still cannot connect the Sula Collect to Red. CZM's lucky that that rocket launcher spawned there for him because he ran out of rockets and would have no way to give assault to Cooler as he went for that red armor. Nine minutes, two seconds on the clock. We got about six minutes left to go. CZM at 165, Cooler at 158, 180. And despite the fact that Cooler has had more health and armor pretty much this entire game, uh, CZM is still done. Hold on, we got a chat battle here in the mega room. Cooler's going to grab that one, four to three, and finally all that health and armor, finally. It pays off. Nine minutes, 25 seconds on the clock. He grabs another red, and he's in good position to convert for one more. Yes, he is. Cooler will just hold off and try and lie and wait for CZM. The rockets just rain down at that yellow armor. He knows exactly where CZM is. Grabs the, grabs the five. No, he doesn't, in fact. As uh, now we see Cooler just dropping down. And uh, by CZM, back oh! turn, connects. And that's a beautiful strike down on CZM. And suddenly, a two-point lead guess to Cooler. Guess, guess what, Toss? That's why he didn't grab those Fives because CZM would have heard those in the position that he was in, and that was a very, very smart move by Cooler. And just goes to show how intelligent of two players we have got here on this final for the ESWC 2005. Now we've got 10 minutes on the clock, so we've got five minutes left to go. Don't get too discouraged out there, folks. Two frags on DM13 is totally capable of both of these players, but the shaft comes out. Cooler gets the best damage on that one. CZM down to 71 points of health. He's buying that mega health from Alco, but there's nothing in it at the moment. He's going to drop some rockets down there, hoping he can get in once again. Where is Cooler? No one knows. He drops down from above to grab that mega, and he forces CZM out once again. He's going to continue to rain down rockets. And into the middle oh. level, Cooler drops down, lands a rocket. 6 to 3 is now the score. And CZM beats Cooler once again. He's going to have about 4 minutes remaining. Wow. Man, there's another cool, one. Great that. conversion. 7-3. You want definition to back to the wall? CZM's back is up against the granite here because Cooler is four away and with exactly four minutes to go, it's going to take a frag a minute from CZM. Doable, but against Cooler, it's that much harder. He's really going to have to get some lucky spawn, uh, just like Cooler had really on DM6. CZM looking for that frag, but Cooler is going to get it. He's down to 50 points health. Can the machine gun do it? The job. 44 points health for Cooler. No. Cooler's going to stop on the middle level, grab himself that red armor, and make his way back to the middle. 11 minutes, 21 seconds, instantly going back to that mega yellow armor, up the jump pad to the grenade launcher room, and now firing away at that yellow armor over on the side on the top level. 11 minutes, 32 seconds on the clock. He still sees that that yellow armor there and decides, yeah, now is probably a good time to do it. He baited it before for CZM, and now he's going to drop down. CZM finds him. He lands one rocket. Oh, oh no. does a backflip into the lava, losing a frag, 8-2, he even gets himself with yeah, I mean, CZM thought he'd take this one on two maps. Cooler thought CZM would take this on two maps. We're on the third map. Cooler is in the lead. And with three minutes to go, Cooler's odds on favorites to win it. And who said he would? I, I, I don't know. I, I, 
I'm not saying anything. I'm, I'm worried. Three minutes left on the clock. 65-79 for Cooler. He is in a vulnerable position. And uh, we're going to just see. Let's check out CZM 152. And he really needs a mega a power-up. Uh, I, I, I hope you guys that don't have money on this game because it may be bad news for CZM. Everyone thought he was the surefire winner. But right now, Cooler is showing that he has what it takes. Two minutes and 30 seconds remaining. Can six frags be done? What do you guys think? Oh, they don't look too uh, confident. They, they don't want to say no because they don't want to believe that it could be true. CCM finds Cooler and once again he gets in his defensive position, but he gets oh, wow. the frag. Cooler is going to get it back on him, but that's going to equalize thing, and that will be a good thing for CCM going into the final two minutes of this matchup. CZM knows it's now or never with the equalizer, double frag there, and as he spams those rockets, picks up the Mega, will slowly make his way around uh, on top, sees Cooler, now, now it's the LG shot coming across from Cooler, CZM falls down to the lava, out for the count, and now it is not good news. No 10-3 to three with less than two minutes left to go, Cooler could be crowned your champion, oh. CZM blows himself up, now 10-2. to two. What can you do? Eight frags deficit for these guys. One minute, 37 seconds left on the clock. Cooler's going to get another one, 11 to 2. Expect a good game from CCM here in the moment because he already knows that he lost. Cooler will be your Quake 3 ESWC 2005 champion. Sorry, Cooler guys. for the win. Sorry, guys. 13 minutes, 45 seconds on the clock. 1 minute, 15 seconds. Let's follow CZM and see if he can maybe get that one frag for you guys to finish this one up. As long as he can get that last lap, it'll be all good. 1 minute, 5 seconds left on the clock. He knows that CZM's in defensive mode. And no, Cooler's still going to get it. 42-12 there for Cooler in health and armor. And is now a 10 point game. So close, so close. So close. Tied for free for such a long time. Now 13 to 2, but you know, CZM doesn't give up. 45 seconds left on the clock. There it is! CZM gets it 13 to 3. Will that be the last lap for CZM? He wants one more. He's not satisfied with just that one. He wants to give you guys two. And there is 30 seconds left on the clock. CZM still going after Cooler like there's a chance to play this game, and that's the kind of game that I like to see. No good games, no two minute Evo hub games, nothing <laughs> like that. 20 seconds left on the clock, Cooler says good game. And uh, man, I, I just want to see maybe Cooler will whip out some unbelievable half English, <laughs> half Russian comment after this one. But here is the final countdown as we go into the last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and that is it. Cooler is your winner. 13 to 3 is the final score. Do we have a... Uh, and I hate to say I told comment. you so at the start, but I said Cooler for the win. And not only did he win, but in the end, by 10 frags. 13 to 3, very, very nicely done. He takes DM6, he takes uh, DM13, and he gets beat down on Hub. I think after this, CZM should go and start his very own tournament. Hub only, yeah. single elimination, and then we'll see what's up, right? Okay. But Cooler not only d takes the win, but he stops the American clean sweep. He does fantastically well to do that because, you know, the Americans are taking the CS women's. They're in a great position with complexity going on a 10-run dominance over Lunatic. But now, Cooler is the stopping force. We'll see in the CS finals whether the Americans can take their second, but they certainly won't get all three. All right, well, we're going to be wrapping things up here. This is going to be the end of day four. I just want to give my own round of applause to our spectators here. Oh, yeah. We have stayed to the end. Thank you, guys. I hope you cleared out my box. I don't want to see anything left in there. It's all yours. Uh